You've probably heard podcasters like myself talk about the Anchor app and you're wondering um, how they use this Anchor app, what's it about, all of that, all of that. <laughs> well, on this video, on today's video, I will be telling you about the Anchor app, not telling you, actually showing you the Anchor app and how you can use it on your PC and on your phone. So if you're interested in that kind of thing, keep watching this video till the end. Okay. <laughs> First. I don't know if people come on YouTube looking like this, but sincerely guys, I cannot be bothered. My hair is tight because it's really not looking good right now and whew, so much, but just take me as I am, right? So let's go straight to it. I'm talking about the Anchor app today. I'll be showing you guys how to record in an Anchor app, the Anchor app on your phone, the Anchor app on your PC, basically help you get started on the Anchor app without any other any other worries yeah so if you're interested in that kind of thing i said that before already yeah okay so let's just go straight into it but hold on if you're not subscribed to this youtube channel and you like the content what are you with tune for i mean i'm gonna be telling you everything about podcasting social media like everything everything so you get <laughs> so if you're interested in that kind of a thing anyways you should subscribe i was gonna say like the video but i would like you to watch to the end and then if you like it you like the video at the end, right guys? <laughs> Alright, okay, let's go straight into the Anchor app. Alright guys, so for some reason, <laughs> I'm unable to record my the screen of my system. And I definitely want to record this video. So let's just go straight into it. So right now, I am on anchor.fm.com. This is what it looks like if you already have a podcast. Um... This is the dashboard where you see everything like my logo, my podcast name. If I wanted to edit it, I would definitely click here to edit. Um, it is available on eight platforms. Um, if I want to view public sites, that's places it is on. But I'm not going to do that now. My Facebook, Twitter, URN, and all of that. So here you can see like your performance. I already told you guys this, right? So yeah, estimated audience views. Now this here isn't working because I'm in Nigeria, which is go to your wallet, I have zero dollar. But people who were abroad, they would actually have more. They would actually have money here, but people like us are in Nigeria. They're not paying us because it's a long story. We'll talk about that another day, Sha, but let's keep going. So yeah, this is like my statistics. God, I can't believe I'm showing you guys all of this, but anyways, who cares? So this is it. Um, does I like my the data, the back end? This is me showing you guys the back end, what it looks like on the system. You see that? I'm not gonna explain all of this because what you're looking at right now is just my statistics. So yeah, now we're down to the end. So let's go back up and let's if we wanted to um if I click on episode, this will give you more details on my like <laughs> more numbers all of that we might click on it later but if you want to start a new episode this is where you'd come to you can see where i have new episodes as so i click on um here would be setters this is distribution like places where i want it on um setting update settings if there's anything you want to update or change out if you want to log out from my account if you need help that's where it is um you need to if you want to record a new episode that's like new episode there you have it like record if you want to record you definitely click here to record then you can either decide to use your like your inbuilt laptop um laptop microphone or you can connect a microphone just same way you connect your um your earphone to your system to listen to the music or watch something then this here is messages. Did you know that you can actually send like a voice message when you listen? You know when you're listening to a radio and people tell you to call in. Yeah, with Anchor you can also do the same. You can actually send voice messages to whoever it is you're listening to their podcast. I think that's really cool. So guys, if you listen to a something's run podcast, make sure to use it. Like yeah, library are like where all your audios go to after you record. It goes to your library before you now edit it and then it goes to an episode for today i am not going to be recording anything i'm just showing you what it looks like here on the system and how you can go around it so yeah so if you want to record you definitely click here 
So let's go to settings and just click on. No, let's go to episodes. Oh my god, I'm going to show you guys now. Month that is spa. It's okay, no problem. We're all going to be fine. You know what? You're not going to eat starters. Starts, starts, right? So that's taking a while. So let's see. Mm -hmm. So those are all the details you're about to see. <laughs> yep, 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 yep. So like, yeah, it's like the stats on my podcast. Um, so you see, this is what you have here. Um, yes, yeah, so I think that's all there is here. Right? Okay, so then you go here, distribution. When you want to submit, I've told you in the past, we're going to talk about this in like full in another video, but when you need to, when you need to distribute your podcast, this here is called your RSSS feed. Now we found that from going to settings and clicking on distribution. If you want, if I wanted my podcast to be on somewhere else that it already isn't, I'm just going to come to this place and I'm going to click copy. And then this here is like, this here is like this. See, this is the podcast gone, gone, gone. Anyway, you take this now, you copy it and you save and everything. Your podcast will be available there. So this here is showing you all the links to my podcast on different platforms. Yeah. So you see, if I wanted to distribute to um, Castbox, all I need to do is copy the link that the RSS feed and then just submit it to them. I'll show you guys how to do that in coming videos. Um, then you can also go to update sets and if you need to, um, yeah, if I need to change anything here, my words, um, all of those, this is where I'd come to, um, see, these are like things you find here, but I'm not changing anything today, today is not a day I change anything, so, Tracy, so this is how it is. Um, if I want to log out, I don't log out because I can't remember my password right now, but this is where I'd log out if I needed to do that and yeah that's really all you need that's how it looks like on your laptop now let's go see what it looks like on the phone and things you need to know on the phone yeah shall we hi hey, so this is the anchor app on my phone anchor app is available on ios and android um this is an iphone but you can find it anywhere so this is what you see first when you open up um, you see below, you see um, tools and you see your podcast and you see discover. Um, so the first thing I usually would do to start recording is to click on your tools and then this will open up. There you can record. There you can also send the voice message. Remember we talked about this before. And there, there you see your library. This is where episodes are recorded. Where I tell you I have drafts of episodes that I haven't published yet. That's where it is. Um, here you have sounds and songs if you want to edit and add all of those. Then also, next up is um, your podcast. Again, this is where you see your statistics, which is the same thing as um, on the PC. But that shows you more details than this. You saw that we saw all of those kind of things. More things on the PC than here. So this is what you get on your phone. Um, so this is also the stats. And also that money thing, but I can't get money because, again, I'll tell you guys about that later. This is also the um, your setting, distribution if you want to send it out so this is your notification this is where you you see a bell up um, that's where you find out people that are probably liking or yeah, interested in writing your podcast all of that yeah so all of this in your analytics basically um, now this is where you discover if you click on the discover I just clicked on discover so this is where you find like podcast new podcast um, I'm trying to search for 20 something rounds but I think Something went wrong there, eh? mm, I don't know why. Probably because it's my own podcast, so it didn't open up. But, well, what I was trying to show you guys there is that you could search for podcasts that you want to see. And you can search for people if you don't know a podcast, but you know the new other person. Um, so you can always check for that. So, basically, you see podcasts that are available on Anchor. Here's some of them. You know, I told you that you can actually listen to podcasts here to um, anchor up so yeah so that's what it is this is where that all of that happens and again you can send voice message you can record with friends you can add background music um this is my latest episode so far people who have listened to it. um 
And then I think for a moment, let me show you how you can invite friends there to join. This is how you code with your friends. That's where you go to invite friends. And then it gives you the option of where your friends are on Anchor Friends, Message, Twitter. I will show you in another video how to record with friends proper, which is best to use. But that's how you want to go on it if you intend to do that. And so that's basically it, guys. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like and subscribe.